In my previous video, Digital Sound Generator SN76489 was programmed using Arduino to play tones at different frequencies. In this part 2 video, the chip is programmed to play multi-tones using three tone channels and a noise channel. The chip is also programmed to play a sample music of a retro game back from the 80s. In this example, we will play three different tone frequencies at the three channels of the IC. First, we will play at channel 0, 122 Hz tone for two seconds. And these are the two bytes required to play the tone. And then we will play 200 Hz at channel 1 together with the channel 0 tone for two seconds. And then we will play at the channel 2 500 Hz tone together with the channel 1 and channel 0 tones. We will also play two types of noise sounds over the noise channel, namely the periodic noise and the white noise. For the periodic noise, this is the byte we sent to the chip, where the feedback value is 0 here, and the shift rate or the noise frequency is 1, 0, which is equivalent to dividing the uh, oscillator frequency 4 megahertz by this value which is approximately 2 kilohertz and for the white noise this is the byte where the feedback value is 1 and the frequency is again uh, approximately 2 kilohertz A quick look at the C++ code. Within the loop function we set channel 0 to maximum volume and then we play 122 Hz tone at channel 0 for 2 seconds. And then we set the volume of channel 1 to maximum and then we play the second tone 200 Hz at channel 1 for 2 seconds. And we set the uh, channel 2 volume to maximum and then we play the third tone 500 Hz at channel 2 for two seconds and then we mute all the channels for one second. Next we set the volume of uh, the noise channel to maximum and then we play the periodic noise for two seconds and then we mute the noise channel for one second and then we set the uh, volume again back to maximum and then we play the white noise for three seconds and then we mute the noise channel. In this next example, I'll play a short piece of music from the retro game Chucky Egg, which was popular back in 1983. And these are the musical notes for this piece of music, which I obtained from the internet. And uh, using online uh, tools, you can easily translate the note into tone frequency. And then we find the hexy value of each tone. A quick look at the C++ sketch. We use variable i to set the tempo of the music, which is the beats per minute. Then we send the first tone through channel 0. And then we use this for loop to attenuate the volume of the tone gradually. This will give us what is called the tone duration. And we do the same with the rest of the tones. In a future video, Using the SN769486 chip, I will demonstrate how to play ringtones coded in ringtone text transfer language, which was developed by Nokia. Thank you for watching.